All right, yo, what's going on, you guys? I'm Flaparts, and welcome to another Call of Duty Vanguard video, where today we'll be taking a look at one of our operators, which will be weighed for today's video, along with the rewards you guys get for leveling him up, and what happens when you guys max out this operator. But just before we hop right into the video, if you guys could drop an early like here on the video, that would be absolutely great, as it always helps out both the video here and the channel as well. And while you're down there, leave a comment down below and let me know which of your operators here is your favorite operator and why. I'd love to hear about it. But with that said, let's get right into the video. So with every operator, including Wade, of course, they have a set of four regular challenges you guys can complete. And for each of those challenges, they have three stages to complete that accumulate with higher rewards. And then finally, there are progression challenges and rewards for leveling up that operator. So in our case of Wade here, his four challenges consist of the following. The first challenge being that you have to get three, five, and then 10 wins as Wade, which will reward you with 1,000, 1,500, and 2,500 XP respectively. For the second challenge it'll be to get 10 25 and 50 fire kills as wade which will reward you the same amount of xp respectively for the third challenge it's going to be to get 25 50 and 100 hit fire kills as wade yet again which again will also reward you with the same amount of xp respectively and then finally for the fourth and final regular challenge here this is the one that's going to be to get 50 100 and 150 kills as wade with again the same respective xp reward for each of the stages and from there we can start moving on to the more important challenges for the operator that you'll want to know about the progression challenges which aren't actually really challenges i guess they're more of just progression unlocks as you guys receive for leveling up your operator so in total there are 20 levels you guys need to progress through and your operator automatically starts at level one so you technically only need to go through 19 levels to hit the max level of any operator including wade here that we are using for today's video as for the actual leveling aspect there isn't actually a good way to figure out the best way to level up your operator or the fastest way to level up your operator other than just simply having your operator active that you want to use and level up and gradually earning that xp over time during your matches and so with that said here are your progressive rewards for all 20 levels so starting at level two you can get the deal with it operator quip which sounds like this hey i'm better than you deal with it and then going into level three, you will get 1500 XP towards your regular leveling in this game. So obviously that's towards your levels one to 55 and then going to prestige levels and everything like that. Going into level four, you get the American Omega calling card. Going into level five, you get the grounder operator MVP highlight, which looks like this. And then at level six, you guys will get 1000 XP for the type 100 weapon. So it's basically weapon XP for that weapon there. And then going to level seven, you get the unpressured sticker. For level eight, you guys get 2000 XP towards your regular leveling. At level nine, you guys get the ramparts emblem. So if you guys like that kind of thing to customize, there you guys go. And then at level 10, you guys get the third fleet operator skin for Wade, which is essentially just another outfit you guys can choose for your operator. Going into level 11, you guys get a baseball charm which is actually kind of cool especially if you guys like baseball i know someone who definitely loves baseball so this might be something that they're definitely going to enjoy using as a charm for their weapons but then going into level 12 you can get 1500 xp for the type 100 again this is going to be some sort of a weapon xp going into level 13 you guys get another amount of xp 2500 xp towards your regular leveling and then on to level 14 you guys get the no shit operator quip which sounds like this no guts no glory no shit. And then from there, when you guys get to level 15, you guys get the batter up operator intro, which looks like this. And then moving on to level 16, you guys get 2000 XP towards the type 100 again for more weapon XP. Moving on to level 17, you guys get the barrel it up finishing move, which looks like this. And then moving on to level 18, you guys will get 3000 XP towards your regular leveling or again, obviously in your prestige levels. And then on to level 19, you guys get a spray called forward thrust. And then finally, last but not least, ending it off at level 20, you guys will unlock another operator skin here for Wade called Hothead. And there you guys go. That's going to be all of the rewards for Wade that you guys can unlock for the 20 levels that are currently available right now. I'm assuming this is going to only be the max level. I don't know if it's going to go any further than that, but this is pretty much 
all that you guys are gonna have 20 levels 20 rewards and there you guys go now to end things off here i'm sure you guys are still wondering on the big question what happens when you max out an operator what happens when you guys max out their level you guys obtain all of the level progression rewards and complete all four of the regular challenges what happens at the end and the answer to that is you don't get anything special for maxing out those operators levels or completing all of the regular challenges you don't get a calling card you don't get an emblem no secret weapon blueprints or anything like that at all which is a little bit unfortunate because sledgehammer did do something like that in their previous call of duty title world war ii which did actually have some sort of special reward in terms of having a weapon variant for completing their divisions out but unfortunately this time around there's nothing available at the end when you guys max out everything for a single operator and so there you guys have it that's everything you guys need to know about for your challenges and progression rewards for the operator wade and of course more videos for the remaining operators will be uploaded here on the channel as well as i continue to progress through the game and leveling them up but hopefully i was able to help you guys out or hopefully you guys enjoyed the video or maybe even both if i did consider dropping a like here on the video subscribing to the channel if you guys haven't already and turn on notifications by hitting the bell icon next to the subscribe button that way you guys don't miss out when i upload a new call of duty vanguard video here to the channel and of course if you guys want all my other social media links like my twitch my twitter my instagram everything like that or even the discord to find other people to play with everything will be linked down in the description below but thank you guys so much for watching catch you on the flip side arts out